All right, guys, I know I haven't videoed in a while, so I just want to show y'all a new toy I picked up. It's a 2005 Suzuki Boulevard C50. It's a one owner bike. I picked it up for 2800 bucks. Got it, and it was completely factory. Got the saddlebags and the sissy bar and the back seat put on it. Uh, ordered a set of uh, Vance and Hines shorts, staggered. And put on it. They don't have no baffles in them. They're pretty loud pipes. Now, this bike is classified as 805 cc, but if you actually look it up, it's a 819. Uh, pretty good bike, man. I mean, if anybody's in the market and they want to look at a halfway decent cruising bike you can get for a decent price i mean this is this has been a really good bike so far had 12,000 miles on it. i got it i've got almost 14,000 miles on it now i put some miles onto it uh the only thing i've added to the bike is uh, a cell phone holder and a charging port which also shows how much uh voltage and you know everything's putting out on it and how much your battery's got if you don't have it running Works out pretty good. I did put a LED headlight and it's got the clear smoke front turn signals with the LED switchbacks I put in it. Let's see here. When you turn one, they go to amber. And then when you switch them back, they go back to your regular white LED color. Uh, pretty cheap actually. I think the bulbs was $21 on eBay and the uh, covers was 10 bucks and I'm trying to think. I had to get a LED uh, Hyper flash relay and put in it. That was another $14. I already had the wing put on it when I got the bike I don't know that guy seemed to like it pretty good. I seem to like it. All right. I came from sport bikes so This is my first cruiser bike but I mean, other than that, it it really surprises me. I mean, I'm a 300 plus pound guy and it hauls me around like it ain't nothing. We've went through the curvy roads and all that stuff and it does excellent. Real good on fuel. Uh, I'm gonna have to get a, probably get a, some kind of fuel commander or some kind of programmer for it because it is fuel injected. It, about mid range, it wants to pop and crack a little bit, nothing major. It, like I said, I put all the miles on it. It's, it's done me good. It does pretty good though. I like it. The only thing I don't like about it is it's got a safety switch on the clutch. You gotta have even when you're in neutral. I'll fire up here that way y'all can hear it. think about buying a cruiser bike and you're not sure if you'd like one of these or not i'm give it a try man it, it rides really good and it's really smooth it's a really light bike i mean it might look big but it, it's a really light bike it does it does it does excellent i'm hoping to get some more videos on it here soon i'm hoping to get a gopro mount for my helmet that way we can you guys can go and Take a ride with me on it. Uh, current situation on the Duramax. I know you guys, you guys want to see more videos on the Duramax. But actually, uh, <laughs> was putting an inner fender wheel in it yesterday. And upon the inner fender, I mean, it was it was like I don't know, 40 bucks on eBay. It's pretty cheap made actually. But I figure I better go ahead and jack it up and check my tie rod ends my wheel bearings and uh sure enough this wheel bearing was about to fall off of it so well that's great so getting that taken care of so i got the maverick too i'm gonna uh, 
got a big ride coming up this Saturday. I'm gonna try to get some footage for you guys on the Maverick. But yeah, it's like I said, if anybody's looking for a, I mean, even an entry level person could ride this. I mean, it's it's a good bike, man. I really like it a lot. The insurance is cheap on it. I mean, I'm I'm 29 years old. My insurance for liability on this bike a month is $15. I mean, it's just it's ridiculous. Oh, another thing that was added onto this bike too was uh, it's got this uh, cruise control feature added onto it. Yeah, it's a little a little sketchy, but it works. Let's see how many miles I put on this. So the bike has 13,507, and whenever I got the bike, I think it was 11,800 or so. so. I put some miles onto it. I put 243 miles on it in the last just the last couple weekends. I like it. It's a real good bike. Thank you guys. Subscribe and like and comment and tell me some other stuff you'd like to see too. I'm trying to make more videos as I can. It just ain't going so hot at the moment. <laughs> There she is, though. Like I said, that's a 2005 model, guys. It's an old bike, but this was a one owner. It's it's still in really good shape. Well, thank you, guys. Until the next one.